Hey people, what's up? I'm uh, here to do my review on The Rock's on uh, The Rock's new WWE DVD, The Epic Journey of Dwayne The Rock Johnson. So uh, I really liked this DVD. Um, I thought it was mo motivational and stuff and good and whatnot. And basically, The Rock has uh, family members and uh, superstars talk about The Rock and him, and he also talks himself sometimes about The Rock and. Uh, what he did with the college and stuff like that and whatnot, and um, he basically and he also talked about his matches and then he showed matches and uh, whatnot and um, anyway, I know that The Rock would probably say it doesn't matter what you think, but uh, sorry Rock, I'm a fan of yours. I'm part of Team Bring It, so I'm gonna hear so I'm here to do this review and uh, to say um, to just give my opinions about it. So, when I first opened up this DVD, I found this uh, on the front, where The Rock put 1995, seven bucks in my pocket, through blood, sweat, and respect, I relentlessly chase greatness. This is who I am, this is what I do. Dwayne Johnson, The Rock, Team Breen It Strong. And I thought that that was a good message um, to send to fans, because like I said, The Rock's a good mo motivator. Um, he helps people, like, he, helps just, he, 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 he just helps mo motivate people. So, like I said, though, in this DVD, um, basically his family and superstars talk about him. He talks about his college and uh, him coming up in WWE and about him um, being with uh, Mick Foley and stuff like that and whatnot for the Rock and Sock connection. And then uh, and also in the DVD, it talks about um, like why the fans at first did not like him because he was going to uh, Hollywood and it talks about his movies and uh, why fans booed him for a while because he was going to Hollywood and, and he was going back to WWE and stuff like that and um, just like a bunch of stuff like that and uh, then finally near the end he talks about returning to Raw after seven years I mean to the WWE after seven years so yeah and he just basically talks about his his career and in the and then in these other DVD and then in these other discs he talks about um he just basically talks about I mean what he doesn't talk about it but uh he basically has these matches um that were his favorite in these discs like uh and I quit match for the WWE Championship between The Rock versus Mankind and then uh, no holds barred match for the WWE Championship etc and then in this disc um like he does like a rock concert and then uh Near the end here, these two parts here, where it says the WrestleMania guest host and the People's WrestleMania. This was in 2011 when he returned to WWE. All in all, I thought that this DVD was good, and um, yeah, and like I said, I'm a, and I'm a fan of The Rock. Um, I respect him. I think that he's a good wrestler. And even though uh, haters will say that he should uh, choose between Hollywood and WWE. Like he said, he wasn't doing this for the money, he wasn't the, doing this to promote a movie, because he's already making a ton of money off of his movies, and he already makes a ton of movies. He's doing this for the fans. He came back for the fans, and that's what I respect about him. So anyway, Team Brain It, Boots to Asses, all that good stuff. So anyway, all in all, I give this DVD 8 out of 10 stars. I thought it was pretty good. So, yeah. Give me what you thought of The Rock's new DVD.